Hey everybody, how you guys doing? It's Benjamin, better known as Moa Sierra. And today's video is pretty much a, like a recap of everything that's been going on the past month and a half, I think, since I did my last video. And there has been a lot of things going on, you guys. So, the first thing I want to talk about is pretty much, I guess, getting yourself back into love. Because I think... And I'm sure I've said this in a couple of my videos about when you're in love, you tend, tend to lose love for yourself, but you feel more love for the other person, things like that. And I think, I, I didn't quite do that, but I think I somewhat did something like that. As you guys can see, my hair is done. Got my little necklace on and my look. But, and, um, oh yeah, I got my nails done too, you guys. Um... And I just think when that happens, you tend to like, like when a breakup happens or something, then that's when you tend to like, oh, fuck, like, what am I really going to do now? You know, you got to kind of get back to loving yourself the way you was before you was involved with this person. And I think that I'm finally there. I think that's the reason why I had went on hiatus with the videos because I just wasn't feeling it to a point where I wanted to be talking about something, like something so dear to me. And then to hear other people's, you know, thoughts, opinions, or whatever about it. And now I can. I can do it. So, that's the good thing. And I just really wanted you guys to know that, that I didn't want to keep you all out in the dark so long. Because I know, you know, y'all love me. Y'all miss me. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much is about that. But everything else, I think, you know, like, I've been... Let me see, how can I say this? Like, not really mentally abused, but I, I was verbally abused by someone that I thought could have been a potential candidate. But, you know, they ended up showing me their true colors after a while, and we had to snip that in the bud. So, you know, everything was seemed like it was right back on track or whatever, and then, you know, um, I was working, of course, and that was going good and things like that, and then it just seemed like you know, something just wasn't still gelling right, you know, and then I end up, you know, dealing with another, like, breakup or something like that, and it really sent me over, but I'm good now, and it's just, it's nice to know that I have YouTube to have as an outlet to speak on my, you know, personal opinions about when you're finding love, when you're getting in love, when you're out of love, and every other little situation in between. Because I think people sometimes forget the basics of when it comes to love and things like that. And I think that's why I'm here. I'm a voice for that love that people, you know, really want to hear about. Because it's not all, you know, reality TV. It's very much, you know, a lot of heartbroken and a lot of, you know, trust and things like that. There has to be a lot of valid points in a relationship in order for it to, you know, to blossom and grow and get to those higher levels and things like that. And over the past month or so, I think that happened a lot to me and I just was so irritated because I'm looking like, you know, how can I keep doing these things and people not seem like we can't get to, you know, phase two or phase three and things like that because why? Because we just not even on the same level. We we really not even in our level, you know, because it's just we can't even grow and blossom together. And I think when you know how to, like, I guess find love back because I don't want to say that, oh, you got to love yourself before you can love somebody else. Uh, no, it's not even going to work. So I just think when you try to get back to loving yourself, then that's when you know that you can give it out in a more um, different shape or form or whatever, you know, like because sometimes I think that's just it. You know, you don't want to seem like you're being too forceful, but you want it to be real smooth and neutral and mean natural about about the situation and things like that so um i just think that's something that i really paid attention to these past couple of a month and or so whatever it's just like i was loving myself and i was liking this person but at the same time i feel like i was you know in more in life with them than in tune with me loving myself back so um, I just really wanted to put that out there. I was actually trying to think about should I make this video longer or not, but I was like, I ain't gonna do all that. I'm gonna keep it real cute for you guys because I'm gonna make another video this week and it'll be a little more detailed, descriptive about things or whatever. But 
I'm telling you, like, when you have these therapeutic moments or whatever, or these epiphanies or things like that, go with them. Because, one, it's more than likely going to make you a better person. Two, it's going to somehow, you know, improve the things that's going around you in your life or whatever. And then, three, you just really want to be balanced. Everybody always wants to be balanced. It's like a key word of mine, like balance. You know, balancing your life, your work, your love, everything has to have to have its, you know, format. Because once that's established, then you know that you have the love in yourself to, you know, be back in that place, you know, to distribute it out and everybody else can kind of see it, you know, you're, you're happy about it and things like that as well. So, that's pretty much about it. I'm thinking about rede redesigning the um, website just a little bit, like nothing, you know, bigger. I, I'm, I'm trying to keep this channel very simple and, you know, simplistic because I think with a lot of other YouTubers, I think people always want to glorify everything. And I mean, it's it's nice every not, now and then. It's nice to see eye candy. But I think when you, sometimes people just want to feel like they're just talking to just a regular person. And I think when you keep it simple, when it comes to your overall, I guess, appearance and, and the way you go about, you know, vibing with people, then they, they get more of a genuine feel for you. Because I know I'm fabulous, but... The thing is, like, I don't have to always show that 24-7, you know. You can see me, you know, with, with a fucking bonnet on, and I'm going to still give it to you, you know. So, <laughs> that's pretty much how I want to give it to you. So, of course, I had to, you know, jazz it up for the hair and stuff. But anyway, but anyway, <laughs> I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm back and ready to attack once again and I've been gone for too long and now I think it's time I bring it back and I'm gonna stay back and on it yeah so that's pretty much about it I love you guys thank you for subscribing to my channel adding me uh whatever you know any type of words of encouragement things like that I really appreciate it thank you guys I love you guys and bye bye